Hi everyone, Anthony Morganti here. I have a very quick Lightroom video for you today, more specifically a video on Lightroom Classic. If you ever find that you have a difficult time finding a specific folder or collection in Lightroom Classic, there's a couple different things you could do that will help make that folder or collection stand out. The first thing you could do is you could give that folder or collection a color label. Now, if we look at the library module of Lightroom, in the left-hand panel, you could see where we have the folders tab. And here I have a folder called Outer Harbor. And inside of this folder, I have another folder, July 30th, 2021. And let's just say, for the sake of argument, that I often access this folder for whatever reason. And I have a difficult time remembering July 30th, 2021. And I often click through all the other folders here. Well, I could give this folder a color label to make it stand out a little more. To do that, just right-click right on the folder, then go to Add Color Label to Folder, and then give it a color label. I'll give this a red color label. And you can see that there's a little red bar there now, and it just makes it stand out. So I'm if, if I'm on another folder, and I want to find this folder that I often access, I could just look for that red color label and jump to it right away works for collections as well. If you have a collection, I have a collection called Skies. These are the actual sky images that I give away for those that purchase my Photoshop course called Photoshop Unleashed. I'll have a link to that in the description below this video. But let's just say that I access this collection a lot. And let's pretend I had a lot more collections and find it uh, difficult to find it. Well, just right-click right on it, then go down to Add Color Label to collection and let's give this one a yellow color label and you can see there's a little yellow bar there now to remove the color labels just right click on that folder or collection again then go down again to this case add color label to collection but instead of giving it a color just click on none and you'll see you'll remove it and you could do the same thing for the actual folder as well just right click right on the folder then go down to add color label to folder but just go to none and you'll remove the color label now, there's another thing you could do to make a folder or collection stand out. That is, make it a favorite folder or a favorite collection. To do that, just be clicked on the actual folder or collection that you want to make a favorite. Then go down here to the film strip. Now, the film strip has to be showing. So if your film strip isn't showing, make sure it is by clicking the up or tapping the up six key. Then You'll notice right here it has the file name that I happen to be clicked on. Well, that's actually a little menu. Click on that and a menu will appear. And you could go down here to add two favorites. And when you do that, what will happen is when you click here again, it will be in the favorite sources right here. So it doesn't matter what folder you happen to be in. It could be in another folder. Just click there. Go to your favorite sources and click on it like that. Same thing for a collection. I'm in this collection skies again. I could then go down here to this little drop down, go to add to favorites, and now it's there. And you'll notice that I have two favorite sources, that folder and this collection. So I could be anywhere. I could be in a wholly different area of Lightroom in this folder, and I could come down here to this drop down, and I could jump to my collection of skies, or I could jump to that folder I was in previously. Now, if you want to remove something from favorites, just make sure that you're in that folder and then go to this drop down again and then go down here to remove from favorites. And when you do, it will remove it from your favorite sources. Same thing for that collection. Just make sure that you're on the collection that you want to remove from favorites. Go to the drop down, click on it, and remove from favorites. And now you'll notice I have nothing in my favorite sources. So those are two different things that you could do to help you make a folder or collection stand out a little bit so you could more easily find it. Thank you, everyone who watches my videos. I really do appreciate it. Talk to you guys soon.